The ITIL service value system describes how all the components and activities of the organisation work together as a system to enable value creation. Each organisation's service value system has interfaces with other organisations, forming an ecosystem that can in turn facilitate value for those organisations, their customers and other stakeholders. We're now going to look at the ITIL service value system in more detail. Remember, there's only one question on the ITIL service value system specifically in the exam. The purpose of the service value system is to ensure that the organisation continually co-creates value with all stakeholders through the use and management of products and services. Opportunity represents options or possibilities to add value for stakeholders or improve the organisation. Demand is the need or desire for products and services from internal and external customers. Opportunity and demand trigger activities within the ITIL service value system and these activities lead to the creation of value. Opportunity and demand are always entering the system but the organisation does not automatically accept all opportunities or satisfy all demand. A guiding principle is a recommendation that guides an organisation in all circumstances, regardless of changes in its goals, strategies, type of work or management structure. A guiding principle is universal and enduring. ITIL defines seven guiding principles which we'll look at in more detail in the guiding principles section and there'll be a lesson on each one. The seven guiding principles are focus on value, start where you are, progress iteratively with feedback, collaborate and promote visibility, think and work holistically, keep it simple and practical and Optimise and automate. Organisational governance is a system by which an organisation is directed and controlled. Organisational governance evaluates, directs and monitors all the organisation's activities, including those of service management. The central element of the service value system is the service value chain, an operating model which outlines the key activities required to respond to demand and facilitate value realisation through the creation and management of products and services. We'll look at the service value chain in more detail in the next section. A practice is a set of organisational resources designed for performing work or accomplishing an objective. The ITIL service value system includes general management practices service management practices and technical management practices. Continual improvement applies to the entire service value system as well as to all of the organisation's products, services, service components and relationships. The service value system includes the ITIL continual improvement model, the improved service value chain activity and the continual improvement practice and we'll look at those in more detail later in the course. The ITIL service value system describes how all the components and activities of the organisation work together as a system to enable value creation. Each organisation's service value system has interfaces with other organisations forming an ecosystem that facilitates value creation for the organisations, their customers and other stakeholders. The ITIL service value system is a powerful holistic construct for the governance and management of modern products and services that enables organisations to create value with consumers. The service value system includes the service value chain activities supported by universal and holistic practices that allow the organisation to manage demands of all types. ITIL 4 guidance can be adapted and adopted to facilitate value, feedback and continual improvement across the service value system.